our nature trails don't harm animals and will be better for the environment. A cow or a crocodile or an alligator is not made to be a handbag or a car seat or a you know, piece of furniture. But our materials are made from the same building blocks as traditional leather. They're made from that, that collagen protein. And we figured out a way to produce collagen that doesn't derive from animals. The demand for leather is not going away. It does rely on the livestock industry, which has a very large environmental footprint. And the livestock industry is the largest user of land. It's the one of the largest users of water in the world, and it's also one of the biggest contributors to greenhouse gas emissions. It takes us less than a week to actually grow the protein. And that step of going from protein to finished material also takes less than a week. The degrees of freedom we have here are really exciting and actually one of the challenges. It can create thousands of different materials. Materials that are thick, thin, materials that are stretchy or more rigid, materials that are softer or harder, all kinds of material properties that frankly are inspired by leather but go far beyond what traditional leather can do.